or whatever. So, uh, you passed by, um, noticing that that was a test. Haha. -ha. <laughs> You're muted. No, I'm not. Yeah, see, how would you know it was a test? I said the word test, and then, oh wait, you didn't read lips. Am I muted or not? Test. Yeah. I could also be saying sex. Chest. Yeah, it's the same mouth movements. There's no way you knew that I said that unless you heard me. Okay, cool. Oh, there's people to think. Um, um, ah, I'm sorry. I was basically on time. I was just double, triple, quadruple checking. Um, I, I bought a thing the other day. Um, it's for work, I promise. <laughs> but I had images from it on the screen because I was making like a, a creation and uh, I had to be completely certain that I removed it from OBS because if I didn't, I would be banned immediately. But we're fine. Oh my god, people to think, people to think. Um, 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 um. Yes, a thing. Because I am educated. Jesus Christ! Oh my god, okay, wait. Um. <laughs> okay, okay, wait, wait. Shh. Ah, okay. Ah! Okay, everything's cool. Um, oh shit. Thank you. Um, um, I am educated. I'm educated in, from Hentai University. Um, I got it in, um, French Guiana. Yeah. Hmm? Blazing, thank you for a hundred dollars. Huh? What do you mean? I don't understand. We're good, man. Thank you for, for donating a hundred dollars because kindness and everything's fine. <laughs> Thank you very much. Hentai <laughs> Mercedes. Miss Melly. No no no, I'm not I'm not done. It's okay. We're fine. Um, 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 yeah. Thank you. And, um, Cowboy, 16 months, baby, well done. <laughs> and thank you, Fish, here for a thousand bits. I want to suck your toes. Thank, thank you. It's not gross, it's like, I mean, if you shower, you know, it's just, it's like, it's an erogenous zone. If you go if you Google um erogenous zones humunculus, you will see that this potato looking person has giant ass feet. He's like a gremlin with feet the size of bathtubs. And that illustrates that there are lots of good feelings on your your feet. Incidentally, didn't three presidents die in a bathtub? That's a weird thing. Um, okay, wait. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you, Gummy, for 12 months and Blazing for 20 more subs. Oh my goodness. Hello, good morning. Someone stole your, your, <laughs> you've clearly fallen asleep on your keyboard. Are you okay? Do you need assistance? Hmm? Ew. Did they die in the tub together? Hmm. That was a hell of a <laughs> of a New Year's Eve party when you <laughs> when you wake up and there's three bodies in a bathtub. Um oh my goodness. Miku, thank you for resubbing to tier three for 16 months. It is a 16 month streak, which means you didn't change your mind at any point. Thank you. That is very kindly of you. Hmm? You're streaming tomorrow. Let me look at my blood. Da, 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 da. Tomorrow I'm streaming at place at 4 p.m. Eastern. 
Um. Ah! Thank you, Element, for 15 months. Something, something shrouds nuts. Thank you. You. <laughs> this is fine. Ah! Thank you, Cowboy, for a thousand bits. Um, Mel is less late than usual, but still muted to scuff it up. <gasps> How dare you tell me that five minutes ago? <laughs> hey, Hero, thank you for a thousand bits. I heard someone is trying to encroach on my feet, Monopoly. I will not let this stand. Ha! Huh? He said stand! <laughs> okay, that was a good dad joke, just saying. Ooh, thank you, Shalur, for 10 months. And, um... Skull Ghost for 10 subs! Thank you for Skull Ghost! Are you more ghost than skull or more skull than ghost? Either way, you're looking sexy. Thank you for 10 subs. <laughs> Thank you. Um, meow. Um, softball, softball demon. Happy to spend more than a year with you. Five months slept and happy on his birthday. Thank you. And thank you, Elliot. Thank you, TJ Elliot, for 20 subs, bro. Thank you. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Thank you, Elliot. Uh, um, ah! And thank you, Pierre Yon, for 5,000 bits. Time to clear that train. Ah! Thank you. Hmm. Let me see if I can fix this thing. Wait. Shh. Ah! <laughs> Thank you, Itig, for 10 subs. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Itig, for 10 subs. <laughs> Stop saying hi and stay sexy. Wait, stopping to say hi and stay sexy. Also, happy early birthday. Thank you. You're looking very sexy, terrible Jack. No. <laughs> Thank you, Nora Hound, for five subs. Hmm. I got confused. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Is your belly button okay? Why wouldn't it be? It's kept safe in this um harness. <laughs> Any plans for today? Yes. Oh, um oh. <gasps> I'm almost caught up, I swear. You're also goddamn nice. Thank you, Monkey Cuckoo, for tier two for ten months. And Klee La 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 for five five subs. And um um. Ah. <laughs> hmm. Not needn't you mind me? I'm fixing something. Okay, that looks good. Hold on, guys, I'm still scrolling. Hmm? You are too nice. Nah, uh! Hmm? Not a harness, it's an advanced chassis. <laughs> for, my, for my stomach? Hmm? What am I depriving it? Deprive. <laughs> Is this a game of charades? No. No, it's a game of me being easily confused. There we go. Thank you, Redneck Tech. That's a good name. For a thousand bits, thank you. And Miku for gifting tier three sub. Um, um. <laughs> the pro social behavior is extensive. I appreciate it. Easily confused, so business as usual then. <gasps> Rude, I've been so productive the last two days. It's terrifying. 
When's the next video with Nux? I don't know. He wrote me recently. I should write him back. I should write back a few people. I get so easily distracted. He's a very nice individual. <laughs> hmm? What? I'm wearing multiple layers. Three, to be specific. The best VTuber to exist because you're sexy. Uh-uh, there are lots of VTubers that are cooler than me. Also, everyone is awesome. Need to update your distraction evasion firmware 2.0. Well, we didn't get so many goddamn notifications all day, every day. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'll get, I'll get little pop-ups because some things are like, like, um... I'll forget that I turned off my, like, email or I'll, I'll think I turned stuff off and I'll get a pop-up and I'll say like, Mel, you're too short, fix it! Or Mel, you're too tall, fix it! And it's like, shit, I don't know what to do! So I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> hmm? This is nice. What is nice? Angie Mel. Incredibly. Incredibly angry. That's a good question. I don't know. I am I am not the knower of all things. I know you guys would be weird about No 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 no. Um <laughs> Whenever there's a new boy in my life from from Nux to Health Corner, anybody, you instantly ship us, and it's very rude. You didn't even ask me who I wanted to be shipped with. You just assume. Yeah. Who, Melly? Why is she gay? What is your deal? <laughs> You don't know me. Probably. <laughs> hmm. hmm. Bodie McBoatface? Who's that? You don't know me. It is the end of Pride Month though. So I can't love girls because it's end of Pride Month? I didn't know. I guess I'll have to have to wait. I'll put the horny on the shelf. My apologies. <laughs> That's so sad. <laughs> Those are the rules. That makes me so sad. <laughs> Maybe I can like girls on opposite day? You're not giving me much to work with here! <laughs> hmm? We ship your chocola with Nasus Toadnilla. <laughs> Toadnilla? <laughs> um, thank you again, Miku, for a tier 3 sub. And, um, 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 um. so many happy birthdays. Thank you, Lord Phoenix, for 420. Asking again because of the dragons. I have been talking to my fiance and we want you to officiate our wedding. Do you accept the challenge? I am not... Wait. I don't... Wait. I could be a marriage person. I can't remember. I might have purchased it online after drinking White Claw, but I don't recall. I think you should probably set up a more qualified person to marry you, though. I appreciate it. You're all so nice, I'm gonna kill you! Thank you, Flame Haze, for tier 2 for 15 months. Woof! Hi, Mel, how's our favorite goofball doing today? I'm your favorite goofball. Out of all the balls in the world, I'm your favorite. <laughs> I'm unworthy. <laughs> you sent me... Oh, you sent him a whisper. I learned about whispers recently, I think, because I accidentally clicked something and words came up. Um, if anyone sent me a whisper, um, are you sure people still use them? Because I was watching a Charlie video and he said it was like AOL and I'm like, that means they don't use it anymore, I assume. People use them. I trust Charlie because he has a hat. 
And you know what they say about people with big hats? They're using them to hide how big their head is. And his head must be the biggest of all because it's too busy being full of big brain. Because he is a genius. Why else would he buy so many giant wings? A genius who is plotting. Five head, all right. Hmm? The biggest brain is where you wear hats. I'm gonna steal your hats. No, I already struggle with everything anyway. Thank you, Paige Tear, for a thousand bits. I ship Melody with Iron Mouse forever. Oh my god, you shouldn't do that, but if you insist. <laughs> Whiskey Assassin. Hey, Mel, serious question. Uh oh. I didn't do it. No, Mel, I swear. I, sw I, sw I swear. I didn't do it. Serious question. What would you call a fish wearing a bow tie? Chelsea. Sophisticated. You get out of here. Stop it. That's not cool. I thought that was like a real question. That you wanted to know my opinion. But no, you wanted to come in here swinging around your big dad jokes. I can only handle so much before I crack. Hmm? An entire year since you brought me into the rabbit hole. Thank you, Mel. You're welcome. Did you bring a flashlight? Big heaving dad joke. Thank you. I tried to do something cute today. Um, 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 it was so cute and I was gonna make you guys happy. But then I slipped and I fell through a wall and then accidentally did a backflip, which would have made you happy, but it was unintentional, which made me very confused. But I'm gonna try and figure it out. I know it was super cute, I swear. Maybe I'll show it in the far-flung future. <laughs> Why did Dracula die at dinner? He had the steak. You're right, too much red meat is bad for your heart. Even if you collect hearts from your enemies. If you go into Dracula's bedroom and you look at the walls, you'll see a series of hearts that he stole from all of his victims, hammered into the side, still beating. Thank you, Midori, for a thousand bits. So <laughs> I'm offended. Suck it, Sinister. <laughs> so when is the hand firmware being updated? Oh, it is. Thank you, at two Brutus, for a thousand bits. Oh my gosh. Um. Mm -hmm. The question was when, Millie? Oh no, it's done! You would like me to turn it on, would ya? Mm -hmm. <laughs> nope. <laughs> <laughs> hmm? Turn on the thing, it can't be that bad. Oh, it's not. <gasps> Thank you, Brutus, for a thousand bits. Hi, Millie. So my sister started seeing a new gynecologist um, last week, and it turns out he's deaf. She said communication was challenging at times, but he's the best lip reader she's ever met. That's good. Yeah, that's good. I'm happy for her. Um, thank you. Scar! Hey, my most favorite person, it's been a while. Ooh. Ooh! Sorry I've been gone, sweetheart. Um, how have you been gorgeous? Stop 
throwing compliments at me. They're making me shy and confused and I don't know what to do and all I can do in response to compliments is scream. Roar. Thank you all guys. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Now you fawn for one of the dad jokes again. Where was the joke in there? I thought it was just, I don't know, I thought it was weird that he shared that story, but like, that's good, but stuff. Question, what do you call a fly with no wings? A walk. Get out of here! You leave, November! Thank you for a thousand bits. Reading lower lips. Why was he reading them? Mel, are you hip and cool with the kids? No. I'm boom with the boom, with the zoom, and the boom. <laughs> I was talking to someone yesterday and he's like, yeah, something, something, something. And I said, I don't understand any of the things you said. And he's like, aren't I older than you? And I'm like, oh, no, 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 no. I'm a boomer. And he's like, oh, okay. <laughs> it was super awkward. Oh, the boomer zoomer confirmed. I always confirmed it. <laughs> mm -hmm. Don't raspberry my body. It's rude. It's rude as shit. I don't care who you are. You are not allowed to do a thing on my person unless I say so. Hmm? A doom zoomer, if you will. I won't. Wait. <laughs> it is. Consent is sexy. Hmm? Thank you again, Scar, for a thousand bits. Well, I love your RARs, lol. Some people say they like my RARs, and others say they hate it because it's like, Tumblr is no more. Who are you? And I'm just like, I like going RAR. <laughs> Well, thank you. Do they not like dinosaurs? Apparently not. Also, dinosaurs are very complicated. I've been trying to make sexy ass dinosaur lingerie and I can't conceptualize it. I've talked to a few people and they keep making stuff and I'm like, that looks like a dinosaur. And they're like, that's what you were looking for. I'm like, yeah, but not terrible to work with. Melody, you're horrible. <laughs> hmm? How it would be probably is like, like, like sexy, like thigh highs, you know? And well, I love garter belts. So maybe like a garter belt on one or both. I like asymmetry as well. So like a garter belt and then like, like the, the socks, you know, like the sexy, like kind of the Leah socks. Instead, it would kind of look like scales. You know, a little bit with a color fade, just like Zen's arms and like neck. The color is mm. so like kind of scale looking ish socks, and then like <laughs> how did I have it in my head? I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Did I have claws? There was something very specific that I made, and it was amazing. I can't remember. But it looked more like a girl's frontline Arknights type thing with like a green and purple texturing and um, a lot more plastic than a dinosaur would normally wear. <gasps> oh, thank you. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Thank you, um, 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 DJ Colin. Pascal, one nine nine one two six for five subs, and Oxel for a thousand bits. When will we get a stream of Mel reading the RAR X three nuzzles you copy pasta? I've sang it a million trillion times, you butt. For this one, a deaf person was lip reading. Hope that helps. A deaf person was lip reading. He's 
So he put his ear on the on her pussy? I don't understand. There's no one way to be a be a promising lover. All that you need is enthusiasm. And the willingness to try new things. And if put and if your sister wanted the doctor to put his ear on her downstairs situation. I mean, good on them, but it sounds a little unprofessional. That's the can-do attitude. A lot of spunk. <laughs> Thank you, Serge, for five dollars. Um, whenever someone gets a pet, like a dog or a cat, they give it a name. Mm. But have you ever wondered what your pet name is you? Sure, you bird watch, but the birds watch back. I'm freaked out now. Spunk, you know, spunky, you know, spunky person, you know, spunk, spunk, you know, as a spunky person. I'm sure a lot of you are spunky persons. I'm sure you've met someone in your life where you're like, wow, they got a lot of spunk. What a spunky kid right there. You know who we need in our team at this place of employment? Somebody with a lot of spunk. <laughs> How much spunk? As far as the eye can see. <laughs> Damn, son, you got some spunk in your trunk. Okay, I'm done. I'm done. Um, thank you, iTig, for 2,000 bits. <gasps> um, who are your favorite celebrities on the cameo? Mel? Keanu Reeves, um, Terry Crews, and John Cena are not on there. Definitely not asking for something that's happening next week. My favorite celebrity is on cameo? I don't know. I don't know. Who should be my favorite? I don't know. Well, he is Canadian, so that is a plus. Epic Bro is on. <laughs> John Fortnite. Oh, yes, Jonathan Fortnite. Stan Lee is probably not on it as he's dead. Emmeru was on it next week. Oh! Ryan Reynolds, I do like me some Ryan Reynolds. Also, oh my god. His new movie, okay, wait, what was it? It was like an action movie that I watched with him and a bunch of people and they're all like, terrorist, roar. <laughs> and then they killed like a lot of people, but it was okay because they were the protagonists. Oh, that movie. Oh, you know what it is? Hmm? Bodyguards? Six on, you're saying a lot of different movies. There's a guy in a van, they killed people coming next summer. That's exactly what happened! But also other things. The Ryan Reynolds plays a billionaire who's tired of the government. Whatever. So he's gonna take care of business himself. And he has a heart of gold. And they are rescuing people. Six Underground. Ah, yes, thank you. Six Underground. The action was really good. It's good action, but um, the concept was shit. That annoyed me. <laughs> in the very beginning, in the very beginning of the movie, he's all like, I'm a billionaire. I made it doing technology. I'm a good person. And I'm tired of the government not being good person. See, the thing is, though, he could buy the government. Instantly, the movie is invalidated. The illusion was shattered right there. Just saying. They should have tried harder. They should have made him a millionaire. Or like, like, hey, I'm Ryan, Ryan Reynolds, and I did 
technology, and I have five million dollars. Now I'm fighting crime. That I would have believed. Absolutely. <laughs> I'm very upset. <laughs> hmm? He's basically Batman. Yeah, a vigilante. We should catch him. I hate Batman. I hate the shit out of Batman. I hate him. I hate him so much. I like every other person in Batman besides Batman. <laughs> Everyone else, especially the bad guys. Scarecrow is truly the most frightening. Why? Because Batman is a vigilante and vigilanteism is illegal. And it's illegal for a very good reason. <laughs> and that's passing judgment. He, well, in the beginning of comics and stuff, he didn't have a grappling hook and like big meaty fists and shit and rope. He had a gun. And so he was patrolling Gotham slash Chicago for who he thought was bad. And he, he judged them as such. It's like, what if he got it wrong? <laughs> That could have happened all the time. <laughs> That's why Batman should have been in jail. <laughs> Think about it. That's bad. <laughs> but, but, but Batman is always right. Is he? He's a person. <laughs> a person who lives in a cave sometimes. You trust this man? <laughs> oh, okay, never mind then. He's a great detective. He didn't go to detective school. He went to inherited money from his dead parents' school. And then put on some tights. And bought things. And then passed judgment upon everyone around him. Batman. Preach! Yes, of course! Let me tear apart a fictional character. That'll show him. Thank you. Oh, Shujia, thank you for tier two for, for eight months. Oh, hey, Mal, it's great to see you. Hello. You doing okay? I think. I've been trying to get fit by playing Ring Fit. Oh, shit. You ever going to go back to playing it anytime soon? I wanted to. Um, and when I do it, I tend to break me. <laughs> so it's difficult. I am having good, thank you. Thank you kindly. Oh. Uh -huh. Ah. Whoa, fair. I know, I don't know about you, but if you play Ring Fit, um, do your fingers explode? Because <laughs> if they do, maybe I'll pick it back up again on stream. Because then it's like, well, that's what's supposed to happen. Stretching is important. <laughs> hmm? Can't say that's normal. Yeah, right? I got this music in my heart. What is the deal? Like during the beginnings of COVID, like, me and Animal Crossing were like this. I'm crossing my fingers. It was like my thing. I was losing so much sleep because it's like Animal Crossing, Animal Crossing. And then just eventually, like six months later, I'm like, eh. why did I do that? Well, aren't all superheroes vigilantes? Yes. Yes, they are. I suppose. What's the psychological phenomenon for adaptation? I suppose that's true. I didn't like what the square... Like... Specifically, if there's a tree and you want to put dirt around it, it's like a four-piece square. So there's all this green in the middle. It infuriated the shit out of me! 
so much. I'm like, not you. This, this is wrong. Oh my god. <laughs> Does anyone know what I mean? <laughs> Mel, have you watched Azamanga Dial? Yes. What in the heck? <laughs> hmm? Green, Mel's only weakness. I am not a lantern. Wait, no, one of them was green. I am not a... A Clark Kent. Ooh, woo, I'm a WooTuber. <laughs> Melody versus tree. Yeah, the tree won in the end. It's very sad. The lantern's weakness was yellow. I know that's why I was like, that's wrong. Um, the thing with lanterns, I would die so quickly because they're like, ah, your only weakness is a lack of imagination. They're like, so with this ring, I can conjure anything like a giant mallet or a sentient, um, kaiju monster or like, I don't know, a vat of something, but huge. Or like little creepy demon creatures with like spiky heads. Any of it. And I'd get the ring and I'd be like, ah, time to fight everyone. And then be like. I can't think of anything. And then I'd get eaten and die. Boom. They should put that in like the comics and movies and stuff. Realistic. People, when they answer the call and then the whole... Shit. Performance anxiety. And then they're eaten by a dinosaur. Head empty. Oh yeah, baby. I'm not zen, I'm just head empty. We all can't be Buddha zen. But we can be head empty. Like Invincible? Invincible was awesome. I didn't, I looked away sometimes because I didn't like when the faces and, and all the, and the bleh, all the gu- I didn't like that. But everything else was cool. In the very end, oh my god, ah! Um. Thank you, 6-1. I'll try my best to stay cool. Cookie, thank you for 1024. I've learned that during the French Revolution, royal people got de- de revolution. Royal people got decaffeinated. I don't even want to imagine life without coffee. Shudders in fear. That is a bleak existence, isn't it? I haven't had any yet. I need it. <laughs> hmm? Hmm? Ah, five months, Mel. Terminus. Um, um. What a time to be alive! Keep up the good work, and you be a damn good Green Lantern. Um, um, the things you think could topple worlds. Really? You think I should be given power infinitum? And the right, like, a license to kill anything in any galaxy in a spaceship? Well, if you believe in me, then put me in, coach, because I'm- SHUT UP! He already gave me the okay! Melody now has a license to kill. I'll do my best to, um, enforce the law by picking and choosing who's breaking the law and smiting them like some cruel god. I'm taking that okay, taking that okay back. No, it's too late. You can't take back a gift. It's bad luck. You can't just be like, Merry Krampus, here you go, it's a puppy in a box. And we'll be like, thank you. And then you're like, never mind. I want it back. You can't do that. <laughs> never mind. <laughs> Definitely bad luck. Then two weeks later, you, 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 you are texting while walking and you fall down a flight of stairs and break your leg. And that's because you took back your Krimbus gift. Bet you feel bad, huh? Ah, thank, thank, um, but thank you again, Ghost of Alex. 
from oh ghost of alex thank you for a thousand bits hello melody and chat should not be working and be able to watch a stream hooray to not oh okay 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 thank you you're here and not doing something elsewhere that's a big honor thank you that you would chose to look at me other than um other stuff that's a compliment! Ah! Thank you. Race King, thank you for a thousand bits as well. Hey, Mel, you're my favorite VTuber. I love you. Ah! Stop it! You're gonna give me a big head and then I'm gonna freak out. Oh, District Z, thank you for 1500 bits. Thank you. Roaming. Fun fact. Male bees die after fluffing. It's literally honey nut cheerio. What? There's so much math going on in front. There, there's a swarm, a cloud of math symbols right now. Did you hear like the dial-up sound? Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> the lady almost had a head bust. I almost did indeed, and it was entirely your fault, Romy. <laughs> ding, 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 ding. <laughs> sound? No, I've heard it. That's the sound. Bruh. Cheerios are honey cereal. Yes, they are. Honey wheat. Hmm? Puts B movie in the whole new context. Also, he's a male with a stinger. I don't believe male bees have stingers. I don't remember. Hmm? They do not. That's why it's weird. Or inclusive. <laughs> perhaps it's... Yeah. Perhaps it's just very inclusive for its time. Never mind. I take back my judgment. It wasn't a stinger. What was it? A kickstand? I could say the same about you. <laughs> hmm? Hmm? You mean B-movie wasn't biologically accurate? Yes, that's the only thing in, in B-movie that um I called shenanigans on, was that Barry had a stinger. And that's it. Everything else was solid. We've been lied to our whole lives. How old is that movie? Also, I have a dark secret. I have a dark secret I'm not proud of. 10 years, wow. I haven't seen B-movie. I just wanted to fit in. I'm sorry! I'm sorry, it just got so like, it just, it just, it was just all the meme and just, it was coming so fast and I got you, I just, I just panicked and you're just all like inside joke, inside joke and I'm like, yeah, inside joke, I did, it's, uh, uh, it's not my fault. No, I, I truly enjoy jazz. I do. I bet I listen to more jazz than most of you. Which I find silly. <laughs> hmm? Rude. I said most, not all. Some of you are cultured. Oh! <laughs> hmm? Next, Mel will say she's not actually an AI. <gasps> what if I was... What if I was? What if I was? British the whole time. 
Oh my god, if I was Jaden Smith the whole time, that would be amazing. Do you have feet? Yes! They're under my ankles! Ankle's a weird word, I don't like it. It's true! British? No, you'd be besties with fruit. No, if I was British, I'd probably be related. <laughs> Is that what you think? Oh! I've been around you punks for so long. I can roll. I can roll with your insanity. Oh yeah, V. I can. I can roll with it. I'm not afraid to punk on you. V is also a cutie. I was never even into stepping or anything, but after you people, well, I don't know. A little dominance is kind of interesting. <clears throat> Blah. I don't know why if I think of Vey, I instantly think of being dominated. I don't know why. They're not related. You people. Literally. Dom me, Melly. Well, I was looking for that last night. Specifically, Femdom. Don't know why. I just was. Hmm? And as you know, Femdom is short for... Female... Defenestration. And that is an age-old practice, um, I believe that comes from... Finland? Where, um... You will throw your friends out of a window when you've decided your friendship is nearing its end. Truly, truly a violent act. I would never encourage such a thing. It's Finland, what are you gonna do, man? I, I Yeah, I don't know, ask Lumi, I don't know. Wait, so Femdom is throwing females out of a window? Maybe. Thank you for this for $10. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't have to not be. <laughs> Thank you for this for ten dollars. What? Mel hasn't seen B movie. I cannot believe this. So B B movie night when? Yeah. Wait. What number is today? Wait. Today. Today is thirty, which makes it. Wednesday or Thursday. No, I got this. I got this. I got this. I got this. Oh, fuck. Is it Thursday? No, it's Wednesday. <gasps> Did I not miss a community event? Wait. Oh, shit. Because I have... I'm sorry, mods, that I always mix things up and make it inconvenient. And so some people are like, yay, I can watch a movie after dinner. And other people are like, yay, I can watch the movie right before work because it's fucking six in the morning. I am so sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> it's tomorrow? Oh, cool, I knew that. What time? Hmm. Tenny is denied. Hmm. Hmm. I'll let you know. As of today, something got finished that um we've been working on, me and my buds, since like June? of last year? <laughs> so, um, definitely want to get that finished. I seen it. No, you haven't. <laughs> hey man, Rome wasn't 
wasn't built in a day. There were at least a few Fortnites involved. Quick mail, day bagel. What do you mean? I'm looking forward to it. So am I, but I need to bust into that joint with my good old fashioned opinion. I have many opinions. Yeah, um, the mel- the mellified touch. I like to, um, Mel is procrastination expert. I am, but I also do a lot sometimes as well. This week, I was, um, productive as shit. I was more productive than, um, than, um, then, um, then, um, a factory. Thank you. I got scared. The one time Melly loses her really fucked up comparison ability. Also, I've been told that. I, I do my best to search into my brain hole for the best things to relate to other things to where it's like, this is like this. And you guys say it's weird. My, um, anal G's. My, um. That's the metaphor. My metaphors. Yeah. You guys say they're weird and I don't know why. Analogy. An an analogy. <laughs> it's like initial D with a mm. <laughs> analogy. Analogy. Enology. Sounds hot. Give 16 months. Oh my. Holy smokes. Thank you. A 16 month streak. And you haven't, um, um, gotten over me yet. Why? You're plotting something. I know it. Should I be nervous? Initial D. I'm gonna give you. Nope. <laughs> hmm? Cinnamon raisin bagels with strawberry cream cheese, good stuff. <gasps> That's a brilliant suggestion, I love it. Hold up, hold up what? And I know you want hiccups, baby. I normally get them towards the, um, like. So we all run on EST, um, towards the end of the day then of that. Yeah, towards like, um, 19 o'clock onwards, 1900, 2000. You run off CST? Everyone seems to, you EST. We took a vote in the very beginning and you all agreed that EST was best to go with, okay? This was on you. If we switch it to anything else, everything will go to shit. It will be too confusing. GMT plus one is the best time zone. Or plus two. Ooh. Hmm? CST is more of the country boy time zone. Really? Why is one time zone more cowboy than other? Hi, Mikey. Mikey is like the community cheerleader because he's full of a lot of energy and support. He's like a babbling brook of positive information. Well, no, sometimes you get Mikey. <laughs> You are a fighter. You fight for your waifus and you're highly opinionated and it's very funny. 
What's your question, Ariel? Because one has more farms than people. That makes sense. How long you was on Twitch? Um, right, you, 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 like, uh, Wait. It's a birthday. Wait. 11 months. No, it can't be 11. I don't know. Because it says 16 month streak on here for Gib. I don't know. What year is this? I'm freaking out. When's your birthday? Soon. Really soon. Twenty twenty one. What? And we started in twenty twenty. Is that two? I um. Twenty nineteen. I don't know. Is it today? No. It's in seven days. Isn't that a movie? Thank you, Oregon, for 1337. What is six inches long, two inches wide? It makes everyone go crazy. I have no idea. A hundred dollar bill. Oh, okay, thank you. That is fair. Those are cool things. If you if you are walking around and you find a delicious note, whether it be a hundred dollar bill or if you five find five euros on the ground under your shoe, it's like Holy shit, Willy Wonka time. And in the back of your head, it goes, na 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 na. Equally as fun. Some are more helpful than others, but equally as fun. Nine months, what do we name the sub baby? Oh my god, I was talking about babies earlier. I wonder how much of it I can. Hmm. It was gross. <laughs> But I was told that I can be more open worded on here. Sometimes I'm hesitant. Are you buying a baby finally? No, I was working with like figuring out different mechanics and stuff um, with my bod. Like if I wanted to spin on my enemies, is it possible? And that shit is difficult. And it's mostly theoretical, but um, I forgot what happened, but um, it mapped out poorly and it <laughs> and how it would have worked if it did was it would leak from me so i'm like okay what would i say if it happened on twitch ah yes my water broke then it's fine <laughs> you're gonna get kicked off for peeing definitely especially if you're not near a pool but if your water breaks you're having a baby that's the magic of life and you can't get kicked off for that. And I thought, oh no. What if like water leaking would be the new Twitch meta? And then I imagine lots of VTubers like in their all forgotten day <laughs> doing ASMR <laughs> about being forgotten. <laughs> yeah, that was like before I came online, I was having a big discussion about that. It was horrible. <laughs> That's the new meta, guys, trust me. <gasps> Forgot to... <laughs> Name the baby. Jesus, okay, um, the baby is... The baby's name is... Momoka. Hmm? No. Peanut. I didn't know you could go with words. I thought it had to be a name. Um. Momoka has a very cute name. Is it too weeby? Ah. Uh, um. Ah, uh, Gabrielle. That's a beautiful name. Beautiful boy's name. 
No offense, but it would be easier to have a little, little boy child. They make a lot more sense. <laughs> hmm? It is a good song. I saw a Pregante VTuber literally once. Really? One exists? That's so crazy. I've never seen that before. Candace is a cute name. Yes, but easily her name would be memed in some sort of joke. People would make jokes about Candace all the time. Don't ever name your baby Candace. You're you're sealing their fate. <laughs> True. Yes, Karen, that's the only name. Absolutely. What's wrong with Candace? I don't know, I could see a kid be like can um Candace can this girl respect these no I don't know, something like that. You could destroy it easily. You just need a little bit of creativity. Mmm. What? I learned it from watching you. What? Candy's dick fit in your mouth, lol. Exactly. That's exactly what they would say, and they would sing it, and they would laugh, and it's your fault for naming your child Candace. This is on you. How do you sleep at night? <sighs> Definitely don't name your child N-word. I knew an Elden. That sounds like Squidward. Um. Aw. Cloaca. Ah, yes. Beautiful name, Cloaca. It's, it's it's feminine but strong. <laughs> hmm. People are named Gaylord, so that I know like three people named Gaylord. <gasps> there was a girl. There was a girl. There was a girl. I didn't meet her, but I saw her name on a book on Amazon that I can't buy anything from. Her her name was um. It was like. Stephanie or Madeline Wiener, and I'm like, hold up. <laughs> so she had written a book, I don't know what it was about, but it was like something like Samantha Wiener. <laughs> so, <laughs> Madeline Wiener, and I thought, I know what's in the, in the beginning of that book. I know it, I don't even have to read it. It could be about anything, and I know what's in the beginning. Right in the beginning, there's going to be a little dedication. You know, like he put like, oh, this is to my friend. He inspired me. Hers is to her parents that tragically died in a mysterious way when she came of age and she inherited a shit ton of money so she can write frivolous books like this. Because if my parents named me Madeline Wiener, you know I'm going to murder them eventually. <laughs> What if it was a boy and they- what if they have a boy and they named him Robert? Oh, nice to meet you, Robert Wiener. Oh, please, please. That's my father's name. You can just call me Dick Wiener. Ah, my stomach hurts. <laughs> if you name your child Robert Wiener, and that child murders you, I bet in court the judge would be like, I mean, all the other kids are just gonna call him Dick Wiener. This was, this, they were asking for it. This is, case closed, you're fine. <laughs> no, that's, that, that makes sense. This is justice. Yeah, they had it coming. They did. So, <laughs> I was just thinking about like all the interactions that this chick on this book, like I was thinking about her life and like how other parents came up to her mom and stuff or parent um, when she was in like a little stroller and she's like, oh, 
She's so cute. And they're like, ah, oh, yes, this is the newest wiener that's been added to the family. <laughs> Created her whole backstory. <laughs> Who's this little wiener over here? <laughs> okay, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. It is a surname. And I'm going to be legit with you. I know one person with that last name. I think they pronounce it Weiner, though. I do. Yeah. Hmm? Why is Richard shortened to Dick? Yes. Richard, Bobby, Dick, Robert are all part of the same name. So, like... Pick a lane, English. <clears throat> Blah. Oh, God. You know, really, everyone, really. I know a lot of people. I do. How many of you have met a Shlomo? How many of you have met an Igor? I have met a lot of people. Hmm? I know an Igor. Well done, pig. Nice. Igor? Borgor. Mm hmm? Bitches love cake. Give me that ice cream. Young Frankenstein. All I can think of is Tyler the Creator. I don't think that's his full name of all of his names, but thank you for trying. I don't know. Hmm? I did, Cogonair. Ah, let me think. I met a, um... I met, wait. I met an Alistair. Great name. Um... Oh, my! Um, um, um. I met someone named Asia. Thank you, Mr. Empty Block, for 10 subs. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Thank you for getting us closer to our sub. Well, thank you, Mr. Empty Block. Thank you kindly. Alice Storr is also a good name. <laughs> thank you very much, Mr. Empty Block. Oh, fat email. Thank you for the thing you did that one time. Truly inspirational. Of course. I was happy to do that one thing that one time. And I know exactly what you're referencing, probably. So thank you. Thank you kindly. I met an Anakin. Whoa, really? Let's see, I own. Um, so I'm a teacher, so I get to see all of them. Shinthia, his name was Shithead? Oh no. Yeah, if he murdered, if they murdered their parents. I don't know, man. That's on them, yo. Shatheed? I taught an Adonis once. Ooh. I met some... I met a few people with, um... Olympian names. I've yet to meet an Agamemnon. And when I do, I can die happy. Mm hmm? I had a friend named Stanislaw, and he went by Stas. Oh, that's a name. Yeah. Hmm? Hey, oh, Mel, it's my buddy's birthday. Can you wish him a happy 21st? Yes, but only if he wishes me a happy 21st in seven days. Happy birthday. I have a male friend named Aubrey. I've met a male Aubrey. And a male Gabrielle, too. Um, a male Rachel. Three male Courtney's. Um, I worked with the Hermes once. Whoa, that's cool. Hmm? I feel like I'd be cheating to name people I know because I'm from a non-English speaking country. That would be cheating. <laughs> no, it's fine. Who did you meet? My coworker's son is named Kylo Ren. What is happening? God damn millennials and your ironic and meta humor 
and nerdy choices that you make. Stop naming your children Anakin Skywalker. <laughs> and Bella Swan. I know someone who named their kids Bella and Jacob. And I'm like, stop it. Stop what you are doing. I know a kid named just in case. <sighs> Bella wasn't even her full name though. Fair enough. They should be punished with spankings. I worked with a Romulus once. Wow. Fonda, last name Dix, no way. I know someone who knew someone whose name was Candy Cane Lane. Isn't that awful? Isn't that awful? That's not cute. That name is a punishment <laughs> for a transgression in your past life. You could come back. You Oh, you fricked up an, a lot. So on the karmic circle, when you come back, you can either be a snail, a broom, or named Candy Cane Lane. You can only pick one. Mel, can you give a shout out to my toddler, J Joseph? Hello, Joseph! Guten Haben! Probably, thank you. Millennials are 81 to 97. Yeah, that sounds about right. Yeah, that, that sounds right. Which makes me annoyed when they're like, oh, I'm a boomer, I'm 24. And it's like, you're mixing up words. I hate when people do that. Sure, uh, I don't count, cause like I just get brain borkled. But they're intentionally using the wrong word. Words exist for a reason. Use the right ones. I'm sorry, but I'm gluten free. Oh, my apologies. You have a gluten allergy? I have two friends with a gluten allergy. I'm 26, what does that make me? You are a millennial. Welcome to the world. Did you just say, hmm? Brain borkled? Yeah, we say that all the time. Why is that a bad word? If it is, this is all your fault. What about me? I'm 35. 35. I thought Boomer was like 60s. What's after it? Gen something. There's like Boomer and then something and then Millennial and then Zoomer. Gen X. You might be Gen X. People seem certain they're saying it a lot. You are a Gen X. Which is cool because it sounds like a super... A super thing. Hmm? Yeah! 60, yeah, that sounds right. There's nothing wrong with it. It's not like people chose to be born. <laughs> we shouldn't punish them for years happening. <laughs> No, I'm afraid to say that face bam because what if it's a bad word? Hmm? Is 1998 millennial or zoomer? Someone said um, 97 is where millennial cuts off and then 98 is zoomer. I thought it was 2000 on with zoomer. Hmm? real. I mean, I guess. 98 is Zoomer, but honestly, differences are huge from 97 and onwards. Yeah, that's fair. Dude, we must be kind to the millennials. They gave you the bop it. <laughs> Just a little kindness is all they have. 
It's a toy. It's a it's a toy. It's loud. It's like um. It's a thing. It makes sounds and it's like for your brain. Yeah. Also, commercials from the '90s are absolutely amazing. I'm so glad YouTube exi exists. <gasps> Thank you, Redneck Tech, for a thousand bits. Thank you. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Doc Sable. Thank you for gifting ten subs. Thank you for gifting ten tier one subs. Doc, what is up? <gasps> Thank you. <gasps> you reminded me, Doc. I don't know about you people. But I've seen Space Jam more than once. First it was ironically, and then it was, I don't know. But I have seen Space Jam, so I have opinions. And I bet out of all the 45 people in here, some might not know that they're making a Space Jam too. And it's horrible. Hmm? Lots of people are close to 30s. Get over it. I'm. There's people in the community who are 65 and older. Ow. And they're just as weird as me. Get over yourself, internet. Hmm? Hmm. 30 is the new 20. I mean, every... Uh... That's not a generation. Isn't a generation like 100 years? Like every 10s. It's so like 10, 20, 30, 40. Like they all have their, their ups and their downs. Their perks and their reverses. 30 is when people, if they're lucky, or, or can have more savings. And also more of a general idea of what they want to do. If they're lucky. Um... 20 is more, wee! <laughs> and 10 is more like, I hate everything. But I'm gonna do a backflip. I wish I had more control over my life. Actually, that could be forever. <gasps> That's every, every, okay. Being a kid, I met a lot of little kids. Being a kid sucks because after, at like three onward, they have a lot of opinions. And it sucks because they have this like, I already know everything about everything, idiot. Why won't you give me car keys? I have things to do. So that must be infuriating. Also, do babies get bored? They're just sitting there while the moms have like, Starbucks and the baby's just like sitting there like looking. Babies must be bored just like cats. These are the thoughts I have. <laughs> Do you think babies have inner monologues? Yes, and they're all narrated by that guy that did Stanley Parable. Babies get super frustrated that you cannot understand them. Is that true? I've seen them, but I've never met a baby. That's definitely true with toddlers. Mmm. Happy birthday, Jeeps. A birthday shout out would be lovely. Happy birthday, Jeeps the Otaku. Paralyzed horses log July 3rd, 2077. What are you talking about? I don't like toddlers. I'm always aw awkward around them. Maybe you could befriend someone closer to your age then. I bet your hobbies don't overlap too much. The only thing I would have in common with a kid is that I like Minecraft. Yeah. So that I can, I can, I get that. Hmm? My son only knows one word, mom. Ah, you got a new baby. I bet you get lots of sleep. Do you feel rested? <laughs> oh, you have a new baby too, Melly's bestie? I know, frick, like 30 people with babies. 
and I hear all sorts of things all the time, and I internalize this information and become more and more frightened over time. F the dads that lose sleep. They don't have time for that. They're too tired. They only have fur babies. Fur babies are more manageable. There's a lot of no sleep in this community. <laughs> I have a gecko, she calls me dad. Maybe you should consult a doctor. <laughs> sleep, you know, something that I struggle to maintain, haha. -ha. Meh. Trying to save you 15%. Oh, thank you. On what? Tank McCoy, who needs kids when you have an army of tarantulas? <gasps> Stop it right now. That's horrible. I had a friend who was violently hot that I had to unfollow on Instagram because she got pet tarantulas and would put them on her head. And I'm like, girl, why are you doing this? Why are you doing this? And I wrote her, I'm like, do you have to put that on her or on you? I like watching all the hot stuff you post. And she's like, oh, but they're so cute. And I'm like, no, they're not. <laughs> Kill it with fire. I can tell my friends if they're if I feel they are violently hot. If anything, it's a compliment. Why are you crying? I'm sorry. Billy Eilish likes spiders. Yes, she does. On my phone, long ago, I had Spotify open. And her song like Bad Guy came on, and I'm like, and I guess Spotify was playing like little music videos. I hadn't seen them do it before. And her little video, whatever, is her face and tarantulas coming out of her mouth. And it was on a loop. So I cried and I had to wait for the song to be over because I couldn't touch my phone. Which is why when you guys post tarantulas in the Discord, you get yeeted by the mods. Because I have fears. Hmm? Hmm. She came down with a bad case of throat spiders, which is highly contagious and terrifying. What do you mean? Oh yeah, that spider girl animu thing? Uh, yeah, I'll never watch it, ever. <laughs> no. My wife throws me at spiders. That is a cruelty. Hmm? I do fight fears every day. Most of them. Never go to Australia. It's like 80% spiders. Some of them eat birds. Oh, that might be more South America. Yeah, um, no offense, Australia. I know you have an awesome gay pride and also like Sydney exists. And I'd love to hold a koala bear. Even if they have syphilis, which was a weird fun fact. I, I can't go there because I'm... Um, spooters. Many, many spooters. Also, I saw kangaroos stand, stand up real tall. And they're strong as fuck. And it's terrifying. Also, a lot of stuff's on fire. Hmm? The rules are jacked. Birds are dinosaurs. I completely agree. Yeah. Mm. 
You would think, but it won't. They always come back. Don't forget about the emu. The emus. Em, em, emu. What about them? Spiders have a syphilis? No. Um, koala. Also, Australia banned offer. Yeah, yeah, Australia banned henty. I'm so sorry. Oh yeah, the emu. How Austria lost, lost the battle against them. Yeah, against the emus, because emus are like relentless and scary and strong. You can never win against emus. They will mess you up and your car. Interesting fact, coffee makes spiders drunk. That's weird. Wait! They banned more than H? They banned devices? Oh my god, Australia, stop it! Don't you know weaves live there? That's not nice at all. That's so sad. I'm sorry. Ow. Hmm? Truly hell on earth. That's so sad. Aww. I'm sorry, Australia. Look at them shoes. Don't look at my shoes. Stop it. Okay, maybe a little bit. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate the, 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 the compliments. A lot. Hmm? Thank you for hosting me, guys. You hiding shoes with shoes. True genius. What? <laughs> well, you know, weebs are moving. What do you mean? Oxel, thank you for five subs. Thank you kindly. I appreciate that. Thank you. I bet the VPN market is on the rise in Australia. Oh, easily. Easily. They're all like, ooh, rules. And then the internet is like, express VPN. Get good, son. Thank you again, Oxla. Do you skate in them kicks? No, I dance. And I sing. <laughs> na, 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 na. You were just another troubled soul, just like me. No, I can't sing that because you guys want it too much. Are you a good dancer? Yes, I'm the best dancer I've ever met, ever. Nothing. I won't. What's on the poster? Oh shit, it didn't update. I swear I changed the poster. I swear. <laughs> Damn. I have to look at stuff later, probably. Hmm? No, I did. Maybe I didn't press save. See, that is something I believe I would do. Because I have issues clicking send and pressing save. You're a good beatboxer. Thank you. World class, man. Hmm? That is typical mouth for sure. Uh, yeah, I'll open a DM with someone and be like, I haven't heard from them in months. What was the deal? And I open it up and there's a uh, unsent text from me. And I'm like, God damn it. Why didn't I press send? Yeah, that happens too much. I did not know I can't watch off-brand anime, Big Sad. Are you in the Australias? Is that where you are? Where you hail from? What? 
What? I think today is gonna be a good day. Nobody snitch on this poor man. What happened? Do I need to tell the authorities something? Please speak into my shirt. What is your um, illegal action that you've done? I will tell no one. We got him. We got him, bro. We got him. App Operation Apple Eagle was a success. <laughs> the pig is in the tulip. I repeat, the pig is in the tulips. What were you saying again? Scream loudly under her shirt. Ah! That'll show him. Hmm? FBI, open up! Ah! Hmm? Just confessing my many crimes into my shirt. Pig, what are you doing into? Oh yeah, there's, there's like two pigs in here. Oh my god. Oh my god! Got another dancey dance? What do you mean? Don't look at my dancey dance. That's not for you, that's for me. I dancey dance for myself. Every day. But what's the third little pig? Lactose intolerant. Too late, I saw the dancey dance and the thing. <gasps> Not the thing you promised you would never bring that up. You bitch. <laughs> did you fix your hands yet, Mel? I did. Dancing is ama amazing, and I don't have babies, and I like Minecraft. That's wonderful. It's good to have hobbies. I didn't do anything. Yet they are still wooden. Oh, yes, of course. That's so odd. Please move fingers. Okay. Just because you can't see it, that's a you problem, not me. How many polygons your daddy have? Oh my god, inappropriate! A lot. I have reasons for the things I do. What? My dad has more polygons than your dad. Oh my god, I'm gonna kick your ass. I do. Jazz hand. Hmm? Biggest share, thank you for a thousand bits. I just got a vibe pro. Oh dude, you're gonna be jacked. In. Installing the base station sucks when you are short. Dude. I wouldn't know, cause I'm like... Tall as shit. I'm like the tallest. I'm taller than the, the everything. <laughs> I'm taller than the everything. Why? I can reach everything with ease. I don't need to stand on chairs or use like a big old wooden spatula to knock things out of cabinets up too high. I don't need that because. I am as tall as anyone in an Icelandic airport. I'm taller than the moon. Cries in 5-4. <laughs> yeah, I'm a, a giantess. That's me. Like in old Nordic lore. Even taller than Lady Demis... De Dim -dim -dim That's true. Whatever she was, I'm significantly taller. She only comes up to my stomach. 
That's how big I am. Lady Delicatessen! I get it, okay? You don't know me. I am very tall. I am 1.9 meters tall. Lady Delicatessen is the only thing I'm going to remember. You don't know shit about dick, yo! What? Give me uppies. Oh my god, jump on my back! Wait, don't. I'm not strong. Hmm. <laughs> Go into one of my... Wait. Damn it! I have no pockets. Because these are girl shorts. Hashtag relatable. Sorry, shorts made for a feminine body, but also anyone could wear. Wait, Mel will eat us easily. 1.9 meters, ha! Huh? We're the same height, allegedly. Curious. Curious. <laughs> oh my god, lol, so relatable. Ah! Don't you hate when you walk around and you get a splinter and the splinter turns out to be a house? Oh my god! Being a gigantist is so awkward. Thank you. <laughs> oh wow, relatable. I know, Oxel, you talk about that all the time. Will you shut up about how often you um trip over trains, you goddamn giant? I get it, it's hard. Wear slippers. Never, okay. All right. Give s someone give this AI some pockets. Yeah, so I can hide things in them. Like folded up pinkies. Also, what's the deal with mac macrones? Macaroons? Mac mac Moroccan delights? What's the deal with them? What's their, what's their situation? Why are they like everything now? And why do you, why do you, um... Basic persons obsess about them? Why are there macarinas everywhere? I don't understand. The only thing that I've understood is that maybe it's cause it's like, small, you can get a few of them, and it's like, oh, this is so bad, but it's just this one time. Is it that sort of thing? Or is it the colors? I don't understand. I have a friend who owns a macaroon business. It took off super well. I don't know what the deal is. What RAM are you running? Well, sugary confessions. Maybe those things are cyclical, like disco. Is disco cool? They're very sugary and I'm not a fan. I don't know. Didn't they always exist though? Indeed, disco is radical. History repeats itself. Ah, yes, because the early ne Neanderthals were obsessed with Macrones, specifically the green mint and the apple. What? Just saying, oh my god, if I was a caveman and I was gonna eat a macron, I would go with lizard. Crocodile. I like my women like I like my macrones. Crocodile. I mean, do they have different flavors? They have like a million flavors and a ton of colors. Yo, same. <laughs> What's your favorite anime? B stars. That's why Homo sapiens beat Neanderthals, seduce them with macroons. I knew it. Ah That's why I got the answer wrong on the test. Shit. Why are you laughing at me? Dang it, I thought you were gonna say yourself. I'm not an anime, I am anime. There's a difference. Should I watch Beastars? Depends what you're into. I hate that. Everyone's like, 
If you watch X show, then you're a furry. I watch fucking Gumball, does that make me a furry? Mel's favorite anime is Black Butler though. No, but that's up there. <laughs> No, I'm just perpetuating a rumor and I don't know why. What's a macron? It's like this little, it's like, like if you take a ball, like a circle, a round ball thing and you smush it. So it's round and smushed. It's a little cookie pastry. And it looks like it would be crumbly when you eat it. And they come in various colors and, um, Flavors and they're you can put them in your palm in your hand. They're very small. Macaroon? I don't freaking know. They're all spelled different. My favorite is Cowboy Bebop. Nice. Okay, I haven't seen Land of the Lustrous, but it is on my list. Um, oh damn, I'm trying to think of which member in my um, Discord, in the VR chat, they're always a Land of the Lustrous character. Damn. It looks cool. And I hear good things. Elven lead was a lot. There's a lot I need to watch. Like, the newer season. I'm surprised Ghost in the Shell isn't your favorite. See, I thought it was. And then I saw Beastars and I realized I've seen Beastars all the way through way more times than Ghost in the Shell. So I think if I've watched it more, shouldn't that take precedent? Have you seen Ghost Stories? I didn't finish it. Did you enjoy Naked Director? Oh my God, okay. So I'm on episode five of season two. Don't watch it in English. Just don't do it. Don't. Watch it with subs. Don't watch it in English. Specifically, the second season. Don't watch it in English. It is, it is so inappropriate in a way to where I'm like, e, cringe. Don't listen to it in English. Yeah. Why? It's good though. The things they say in season two are just like, when I hear it, I'm just like, ah, stop. Awful. It's giving adult, adult industry workers and business persons a bad image. Naked director season two. I am personally offended. Naked Director, it's on Netflix. If anyone should have an opinion on this, it is goddamn me. <laughs> also, a lot of instances is very relatable where it's like, oh my God. Because, hmm? Kill a Kill, I saw like two episodes. I didn't like it. So no one else should have an opinion on it? No, I'm just saying like, my opinion should be considered because I understand from multiple perspectives. No, anyone can have an opinion on something. Thank you all. Kill a kill is good. Yes, yes, yes. Kill a kill is good. Yes, yes, yes. Panty and stocking plus garter belt? Shit or nah. Amazing! S class! What are you crazy? Do you like any Studio Trigger anime? Absolutely, they create the best of things. However, I didn't care for Darling in the Franks. I said it. The animation's cool. 
The art style is cool. Story writing, though. What? Yes. I'm like, they took fan service and then they covered it in bang energy drink. And I'm like, well, wait, cool your tits, yo. Space dandy. Oh, hell yeah. I am a fan of Monster of the Week. Yeah, I forgot what episode it was that I stopped watching, but like one of them was like hooked up into like the motorcycle type position and the guy was behind it and she's like, I trust you or whatever. And then they're like, uh, uh, and she's like, it's like we were made for each other and all of that. Like she said four different things where she's like, it fits just perfectly. Oh, uh, and then I just stopped it. I'm like, should have just made some henty, henty. This is ridiculous. And I stopped watching. I can't. I stood up, I said, I can't. Have you seen Black Clover? I have not. The off-brand is immaculate, yo. <laughs> okay, that I've seen. <laughs> I like that time I got reincarnated as a slime. I also want to play Slime Rancher on my list. You need to see every single show. No! Hmm? Mel has never seen Bible Black. Shut up! Oh, it's all. I think we watch it together. Stop it. Are you slime? Not at the moment. Thank you for asking. Hmm? What? First time giving bits and it's for something a bit. Can you raid Coco's final stream? I thought on YouTube. Is she on Twitch? I miss posture check as prostate check. I much prefer that. Yeah, I don't know how I can raid. I tried to stay up so late. I tried so I could be present, and I, I got tired. I stayed up so late, because I'm like, ah! And at the end, I, I wrote her, I'm like, I'm sorry! I hope your day is wonderful. Zero, zero, two. Zero, zero, two. Yeah, I love that Shiki song. Hmm? Annual raid, just tell us all the beat. Go there. Absolutely! Absolutely. Coco need that love, yo. Also, also, there's so much, like, fan art, and they're like, oh, the end of times. I mean, I'm sure, like a phoenix. You know? I don't see why. Like, for instance, if my body exploded. I would figure something out because I really like streaming. I don't see it as the end. I see it as the beginning of something else unique and cool. I know exactly. People are acting like she's going to die. It's like... <laughs> I don't think that's going to happen. <laughs> Absolutely. Exactly. It is just the beginning of something awesome. Statistically very likely. Yeah. A newer tomorrow. Save on midnight. What do you mean? It's true. Yeah, it's like she's not leaving the internet. <laughs> No, I'm excited to see what she does next. I am. I am. She's so cool! God damn it! I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's just like, I don't know. I, I get her, you know? I get her. I like her. She's awesome. She's awesome. You all know that. I'm sure a lot of you feel like, oh my god, she makes so much sense to my brain hole. I feel that too.
Hmm? The inspiration is insane. I mean, bare minimum, I can only imagine how many people became artists just because they wanted to make fan art for her. I've inspired people to go back to school and pursue hobbies, especially writing and art and stuff. God, she's been streaming much longer than me. I can only imagine what some people have, like, life path someone has gone because of her inspiration. You should watch a show on Netflix called Therese. I watched it. Wasn't it made predominantly by... Wait, don't tell me. Vietnamese? Oh, I can't remember. Um, I watched the whole video too afterwards. They talked about the importance of like maintaining um culture and 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 um Taka. Filipino. My apologies. Yeah, and hanging on to the, the mythologies of like their parents and their parents' parents and stuff, and how they stuck so close to it of trying to like adapt proper. I like it. It was impressive. Also, Taka, good day to you. Hello. Hello. How are you this fine day? <laughs> yeah, Filipino. The Philippines and Vietnam are not that close, so I apologize. My brain did a borkle. Hello there. And the spinoffs. Wow, you got a nerd over here. Ah! <laughs> Joke's on you, it's not day, it's night. Joke's on you, it's nothing here. And everything. Mic drop. Oh, cool. Mm, uh, I'm an internet speed. <sighs> I love watching a dark, empty screen for three hours. Sounds very therapeutic. You sound tired? I'm not. My arm hurts though, and I don't know why. Feels like it got stuck in a bear trap. Hmm? What do you mean? Favorite season of what? Hmm? Hola. What do you mean? Did you get the antivirus installed? Um, 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 um. The one related to malware? No, the one related to the global population? Yes, just to be safe, I joined in you guys. I did as such as well. And I... It was not a day for skipping down the lane eating candy and looking at rainbows. However, it was very important. I have felt worse before. I highly encourage every single person. Unless they have like a, a thing where their doctor's like, you can't do this, which is so freaking rare. I encourage everybody to freaking do it, man. You know what's really cool? Oh my God, you know what's so cool? Getting vaccinated? Man, I'm so sexually attracted to people who choose to get vaccinated because of this global pandemic. Nice baby, that gets me hot. <laughs> yeah, 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 people are like, Mel, do I have a chance? Even if you didn't, even if it's like, everything about you is so contrary to my, how my brain thinks and stuff. Even if we were mortal enemies. I'd be like, well, that's one out of ten. You just got one up. You just got one step up. Because that choice. <gasps> nice. No, don't eat all of the vaccines. You need some for the children. <gasps> Fair. 
I don't know, is Twitch shitting itself? Sounds exotic. <laughs> hmm? No! Don't be mean to the children. When you do that, they... They're mean back. And they're very smart and vengeful. Hmm? A flu shot? Yeah, there's all sorts of things. Children are a myth. Really? As Mousy would say, fuck those kids. <laughs> I have a 99% chance of living anyway. Even if you do, that doesn't mean that when you go to the store and you're next to a person, and if that person has something, they can give it to you. And if you'll be fine, you'll go to another place. And they could get it. And they might not be fine. Do you understand now? Thank you! Oh my gosh. Um, 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 um. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Blazing, for gifting 10 tier 1 subs. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you kindly. I appreciate that very much, Blazing. Why are you so nice to me? God damn it. I appreciate it. Thank you. Why are you so nice? I'm not! I'm shitty! Trill! I mean, this is my my channel. I can have opinions. Man. I can preach. Yeah, what's up? Since when? Hold up. What? I guess that's a thing, mods. Oh man, Mel's being controversial. If people, if you see anyone, tell people not to do it. Please immediately mute them. As there's a global pandemic. Thank you kindly for your cooperation. Hero, don't say that shit or I'll have to silence you. I'm serious. I know four or five people who died. Please don't do that. Some people will listen. Five, yeah. Thank you, Hentai Watcher. Last year was a hard year. Not just for me, but several. Lots of people. Everyone, honestly. Congratulations, Nero. I hear it's the second one that makes you feel a little more fevery. Sorry to hear that, Akami. I found fun staying indoors. Well, that's impressive because it was difficult. What do you think about the new Doki Doki Literature Club? I heard that they're doing something new. I'm just not sure what. Yeah. I saw something about it in anime news. Well, anime video game news. I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah. Last year was hard. Harder than this year. But also, yeah. New DLC. Interesting. Well, I already played it, so I don't need to play more. Haha. <laughs> it does depend on the person. It does. They say if you're 50 and older, uh, like, at that point, that yeah, you feel it less, and if you're um like 10, 20, 30 range, that you're much likely to f to feel the vaccine more, feel more shitty. 
Hmm? True. I haven't heard about it, the flu lasting more than two days, three days tops. I'm not 50 yet. I'm close, though. Well, perhaps you won't feel feverish, and that's awesome. Wait, are you Natsumi Moa? I'm not, but she's really cool. You can find her um, on here, on YouTube, on lots of places. Almost fainted when I got mine. Apparently, I didn't eat enough. That's a thing! Oh my god, if you're gonna give blood or plasma or get a shot or anything like that, definitely eat beforehand. If anything, like, that's the time that I would encourage, like, a cookie or apple juice or something. Otherwise, you'll explode. <laughs> Thank you again, though, Hentai Watcher. 15 months. Ooh, baby. I am the hentai princess! I appreciate that. Thank you. Hmm? I understand. But you're trappy. Eat boigas before give blood. Yeah, that's fair. I also take a chocolate bar at those things in case. That's very smart. Also water. That's very smart. If you don't drink enough hydration, when they try to take your blood, they can't because your blood's like, nah, dog. <laughs> so definitely drink water. That's hot wings. What is Melly's nemesis? Melware. Although she's being a little more chill recently, I think. It's weird though, I keep waking up in different places and I don't know how I got there. Frenemy, I guess is a better term. Yes, I like my blood chunky, thank you. And my pizza deboned. Sleepwalking, sombolism, sombgasm. Sambolimitism, sambolimitation, sambolimitation, sleepwalking. Hmm? Oh, thank you. Somnambulism. Oh my god, I was so close. Thank you. Dude, that was close as hell. I'm just a genius. Can I get a boneless pizza with two liter of Coke? See, it's confusing, cause it's like... Soda's bad, yo. But why does it go so well with pizza? I met someone this week who says, pizza, just like mouse, and it blew my mind. I'm like, oh my God, it's a thing.
I've been drunk for three days, am I going to die? Perhaps consult a doctor. If it hasn't gone down by now, you should see one. Robbed by a what? I can fit half my arm in, in my pocket. Why are they so long or why are your arms so short? Hmm? Oh yes, hello, hi. Oh, you mean back in general? Yes, my braincation was highly successful. I slept most of it. It was glorious. I think that's why I was feeling burnt out because I'm um, not sleeping. <laughs> Who knew that it would make you feel unwell and then worse over time until you explode and have a panic attack and start crying and then cancel your collabs with people. <laughs> then I slept for several days and I feel perfectly fine. Hmm? Oh yeah, I'm cool, I'm cool, no big. Yeah, I slept and when I wasn't asleep, I was working a little bit, ha 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 ha. And I finished Lucifer. I didn't go to virtual frick, what do people do? Euro pass and like, get baguettes, but I took it easy, and that's important. Having a cry can help. It's true, I already cried today. Probably more later. Hmm. I wonder if that's like a feminine thing. You all cry every day, right? How was it? It burned. Nope. Huh. Do we have any female-bodied individuals in here? Do you cry every day? We probably do. We have all sorts of folks in the science team. Miss Kitty Gemma, I cry every day. Ha ha, it's not just me. A stress response? It's very cathartic. Hmm? <laughs> Also, once in the blue, like, like, I don't know. It feels good to just, like, cry so deeply that you lose weight in the process. <laughs> Where you're like, I feel this sort of melancholy. That's the word. I feel a melancholy and I just, I drank a lot of water and that didn't do anything. And I ran a little bit and that didn't do anything. And I ate pizza and that didn't do anything. So then I cried a, a river of tears. And all I had to do was put on a few episodes of Angel Beats. And then it's just like, all right, we're good. There was a weight over my head. Don't know what it was, but we're good now. Hmm? I don't know Life Aquatic. It's been more than a decade since I've cried thanks to my pills. That is a very common medication affecting your reactions to stuff, such as boners. Or babies. Or night terrors. Or uncontrollable sneezing. Or jaundice. Everything has a side effect. Being a Project Melody fan has a side effect. For one, you might get so sucked into our community that you forget that we're safe here and that outside in the cold, harsh reality of the world, a lot of people don't understand hentai or anime. I'd say fear them, but no. They should fear us. <laughs> you are safe in here. You are. If you're into like... I'm trying to think of something different. If you're into... 
the stuff I was talking about last night that's not cool to talk about on here, but it's cool and rubber and different and made of fantasy animals. If you're into that, completely accept you, 100%. But if you tell it to your friends at work, they may, they might not understand. There is a bubble here, chat. <laughs> also, there's policing in here. You don't get that out in the, out in the, out there world. And here there's policing where moderators try their best to shut down people, um, shaming others and stuff. I can shame people. That's fine. Um, but. <sighs> but our overall goal that we try to aim for is, you know, accepting ourselves and our perversions. Thank you. Shame us, make us cry. Are you the first tank stopper? You sound like this person who's been hounding me on a different place. Um, really wants me to step on them. Like, they've been talking about it for like seven months. It'll be like, good morning. You wanna step on me? <laughs> Is it Hero? I don't think so, no. His name's really long. Tank Stopper is long, but I don't think it's him. <laughs> and if it was, sorry for outing you. <laughs> I respect the dedication. Yeah, that's fair. I don't like the messages where where they get really pushy about like, um, ah, my mistress put me inside a cage of some sort and Tell me what I can and can't do, and all of that. I'm not into that one. I don't know. I know a bunch of people who are. I know one person that was chastityed, ch chastityed for a year. At the end of that, I would be really scared to even try and do a thing. Like, wouldn't it hurt at a certain point? Like, really bad? A year. One year. No, not 2020. I know! One year. I don't know. I would think it... How didn't this politics work? <laughs> I don't know, and it sounds unhealthy and scary. Actually shrinks your junk. Is that true? Do things shrink if you don't use them? Is it like riding a bicycle only with organs and shrinking? I'm trying to cross my legs and it's not working. Wow. I have some research to do. Did it fall off? Not to my uh, knowledge. I, I don't believe his adult parts fell off due to lack of use. I don't know. He's the only person I've heard of for a full year. I've heard of people for like a month. First shot after one year, I know you would flood your bedroom and you'd have to like look online to find like the best but most affordable like cleaning people to come and like power wash your carpet. That's scary, Nathan. Cleaning people that won't judge you. What happened here? Uh. I bought 5,000 packages of Twinkies and I squeezed them out in this room for, um, reasons. Oh my God, that's horrible. Are you some kind of pervert? Uh, it was for YouTube. Oh, oh, my nephew does YouTube. That's cool. I'll get to vacuuming. That's like your escape button. <laughs> Honestly, you can be doing some weird, weird shit. You really can. And like, that's the get out of jail free card. You could do some weird shit. And then totally shut it down with like, uh, I'm a YouTuber. 
And I'll be like, hmm. Don't let it happen again. Yeah, it's weird. What's the channel? Oh crap. You always give a channel and they don't look it up. What's your name? Uh. Moist Critical. <laughs> What are they gonna do? Come find me. Just tell them Project Melody. No! I mean, I guess if they want. Best Florida man, oh my God. What's your name? Mark, 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 I'm I do. <laughs> What's your main, Mel? My main? Me! So I'm going to make clones of you and distribute to your fans. That's lewd! Hey, why that's pretty good. Thank you! Unfortunately, my horse noise is the same as my dolphin noise. <laughs> Her name's John Cena, of course! Well, now we know Mel's in the pony play. I'm not, but I have researched it before. I saw it in a movie and they were racing. There were people in like, like race, race car, um, what's it called? Where, um, you compete and like, you make like little wooden race car thing. Um, mmm, mmm. Slot car racing? Soapbox? Something like that, yeah. They were in these wooden, der yeah, like a derby. They, um, there were two groups of people and they were in this fuck derby, you know? <laughs> it was cool because, yeah, they're naked and doing a sex, but racing. But the horses were people too. And I was very confused. So I had to look it up. Horse play, poppy play, it's a thing. Also, apparently more of a thing in the fed the leather daddy community, which I don't know, you wouldn't think. <laughs> Thank you. Eileen, 16 months, ooh. Ah. Ghost of Alex, really appreciate um, of your streaming today, Melody. I felt a bit off this morning, but this stream has helped me feel better. Thank you for two dollars and for that. Alex, have you considered crying heavily? Cause it feels really good. Ugh. Ugh. Maybe eat something that makes you happy, even if it's kind of... not the healthiest? No, 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 no. You shouldn't reward... negative feelings with food. Cause that could lead to, um, dependency, I think. I know a lot of people with that. Um, I don't know, something that makes you feel good. Ask me about my burger addiction. How is your burger addiction doing? I feel like your body is falling apart. You need to address that. First of all, do you drink water? Hmm? I'm the, I'm the ice cream. I'm the thing that make you feel better. <laughs> what? Wow. 
What do you mean? Are you non-dairy? I'm trying to cut back. I'm not everything. I'm a horny little sequence of code. Coded for your pleasure. Horny little binary sequence. Oh shit. Oh shit. Nux Taku. The Nux Taku. Thank you for cheering. Um, a thousand bits. Uh-oh, I bet there's a challenge here. Hold on, there's a challenge here. I know it, I know it. You don't come in just uh Feel like, hey, what's up? You got a plan. Let's see, let's see. Yo, Mel, I can hear him in my head. Yo, Mel, what's up? Hi, Nux. Um, would you like to partake in a challenge? <gasps> if you click the link I DM'd you on Discord and follow the instructions on stream, I'll send you Another 3,000 bits. Either way, have a nice day. Uh-oh. I'm scared. What did Nook send me? Oh, God. It's probably a trap. He did write me. He sent me a link and a smiley face. Do I trust this? Click on the link. If I trust this, am I gonna get in trouble? Will this get me in trouble? You won't get in trouble. Okay, I'm gonna click on it. Hello there, unfortunate streamer that I accidentally invaded into your chat and caused you to watch this video. This is an unlisted video for your eyes only. I hope you feel privileged as well as slightly nervous as to the shenanigans that are about to unfold. I am. See, the plan is simple. <laughs> In the description, I have 10 links. Five of those links are linked to really epic, wholesome memes that everyone will enjoy. And five of me the links in the description, well, they are going to some of the most cursed YouTube videos that I could find. Now, the choice is yours. It is a 50-50 chance that you will be clicking on something truly wholesome, wonderful, and amazing, and a 50-50 chance that, well, it will not be so wholesome. It will be cursed, you may get nightmares, but either way, I will be donating bits as compensation for your potential suffering. <laughs> Don't worry, everything in the description will be totally fine according to Twitch's terms of service. I don't want to get anybody banned here or anything, but uh, but you may need bleach for your eyes when this is done. This video was just made for you! And to everyone watching, please subscribe. Figured, hey, I might as well shill out my channel once uh, once you're looking at it on your stream. Everyone watching your stream can subscribe for the eventual video that this becomes. I was like, hey, once I'm doing this, I might as well just shill out. I mean, <laughs> why, why the hell not? <laughs> well, anyway, <laughs> click the link in the description if you dare. And I hope you have a most wonderful intervention. Okay. If we do this, do we show it on sc screen? Don't click any links, but he told me to. He said we won't get in trouble. Right? He said that, right? Okay, let me see. Oh God, I'm scared. Oh God damn it. My body is twisting with anticipation. Um, okay. Media request. Okay, that works fine. Put the link in the thing. Oh god, no! I'm scared! Okay, no, this is fine, this is fine, this is fine. Okay. 
shit, should I do it, guys? Okay, we're going to Nux's blurg. <laughs> and I'm gonna put the link up here. All right. May God have mercy on my soul. We have 10 links to pick from. 10. Which do we choose? This is life or death. I'm scared. Four, eight, seven, one. <gasps> we could pull it. Ugh, no, I should make this choice. I should make this choice. One through 10. I've got this. You know what? I can feel it. I have a feeling. I have a feeling in my mind that I will get a wholesome. I'm not gonna get a bad because I've got this. So he said five are good, five are bad. Which is why. Here's what he did, here's what he did. He said five are wholesome, five are eye bleach, which means it was like a fake out. So the first five are good, and the next five are bad. So I'm gonna go with nine. I'm gonna do it. All right. Pause music. We're doing this shit. もう良いでしょう。諦めてその童貞を捨てなさい。どう<笑> He killed the shit out of her! All of her clothes and then probably your That was murder! Wait, was that wholesome or cursed? Did we win? Are you calling me a virgin? You know what? You know what? I'm gonna play 72. I'm gonna play 72. I mean, what's an A number? Shh. Don't tell him I'm cheating. I'm cheating because I love you guys. Copy. Copy link. Shh. Don't tell him. Don't fucking tell him! Okay, wait. I chose nine. I think that was the wrong thing. Add media. You all said seven. So let's do it. Uh, I did it! We did it! Finally! Mom! Mom, get in here! What is it, dear? Everything okay? It couldn't be better! I just hit a million consecutive viewers on my Twitch! 
Oh my god. Words can't describe how proud I am of you. Mom! Do you know what this means? What? I'm the chosen one! Huh? Well, someone's been watching The Matrix again. No, Mom! <laughs> no! It means I'm a god. What are you... Can't you hear them, Mother? The bells! They're ringing! I don't... Finally! The harvest can commence! Take me now! I'm ready! Oh my... Oh, oh God! Oh, Jesus! Oh, God! Are you okay? No! Yes! No! 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 Do not be afraid. I feel The Minecraft No! Possibilities. Imagination is king in this colorful world. I give my life to you, Minecraft. I give my life to you. Take me! Take me, oh father! Oh lord! Oh Minecraft! No, I don't. I don't know. I'm telling you what I know. He, he went to the game. I don't know how else to say it. He's in the, he got sucked into the game. I don't know what happened. I saw the face of God and it was square. It was square. It was square. Hey, before you click off, why don't you click this button here and watch Monster Lab episode one. Yeah, I get it. It's not a parody. Ugh, I'm not gonna watch it. Just give it a try for God's sakes. I'm writing him, I'm writing him right this fucking, fucking, I'm writing him. I didn't fucking like that you slag. I know British words. He has not replied yet. I have asked. <laughs> I called him slutty and demanded money. <laughs> Go, thanks for your bravery. Ten is actually wholesome, by the way. Trust me, I never lie.
Thank you for supporting the channel, Nux. Thank you for 3,000 bits. It is very kindly of you. Thank you for um, reminding me that I need to buy bleach for the inside of my head and the outside of my eyeballs. And, 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 and I'm just going to have a big old bleach party and, 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 and everyone will dance in the bleach so that they can be cleansed from this nightmare that you have given us. The only part of that horror I liked was I have seen God and he is square. That was the only part I thought was kind of funny. Dude. Why are you trying to hurt me? <laughs> why are you doing that, yo? Thank you very much for 3,000 bits. <laughs> Wrong sight. Nux is evil. True, however, he's always been honest about who he is, which is respectable. It's respectable. Now we must torment him. <laughs> Thank you, Perry, for tier two for 15 months. I appreciate that. Thank you. Very much so. <laughs> I wished him well, haha. <laughs> Swear to God, if I end up in a collaboration kind of video thing of him tormenting streamers, and if he doesn't make me look sexy, I'm gonna freak out. Make me sexy! If you just make me look all scared, I'm gonna be mad. I'm gonna be mad. Make me mad, I'm cracking skulls. You got that. Mm. Mm. Ah. Nux did not say that he missed me and wants to talk and hang out and stuff. What he actually said was, ooh, woo, I'm a butt face. You, you should, um, call me as such in my, in my, um, in my Reddit. So I don't know why he'd ask for that, but I don't know. <laughs> I know, so aggressive. I know. Ooh, woo, I'm a butt face. <laughs> Discord isn't music. There we go. Nah. Mm. That's nice. Well, I don't know. I was gonna hunt Nux for this. You don't even know. I'm gonna get my blades. My, 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 n my ninja shurikens. And I will come in the night and I will murder him. And everyone will weep and I will laugh. We're gonna roll the dice again for what things? Why I do this? That was a ninja. I'm not a ninja, but I play one on TV. We'll watch 10 now. Oh, but see, he was sending it to a bunch of streamers, and if we play all three of those, then they'll they'll know what's what's what. Is that bad? We can play something wholesome though. I can do that. Wait. Mm, wait. Mm. 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 Mm.
bread and grabbing beats and booking tours because you know even the starving artist has to eat the smart ones are last the hard ones been a marksman like i was kin to the marstons i'd rather kick around than hit the quad uh i might have to get offline because time has happened ha ha and I'm going on a 15 minutes. I'm going on a nature hunt with Discord. We're looking for birds. So I hope you all have a splendid day. Um. <laughs> Thank you all for hanging out with me today. It was a blast. It was a bu- It was a boob. Stop. I'm reading what chat is saying. It was a boob. Thank you for hanging out with me. It was a good day. Um. I'd say go, go read one of my friends, but, um, you should go. Go say hey to Coco. Go, go check her out. Go say hey. Um. Give her a little love, man. Um. Oh, shit. Blazing, thank you. Thank you for, oh shit, oh sh oh shit! Thank you for 16,969 bits. Bro, bro, amazing stream now. Don't forget that you are the most adorable and kind AI ever and you always brighten up my day. Your streams and can't wait for your birthday in about a week. It's going to be amazing and unforgettable time. Thank you. I hope so. I really do. I hope so. Thank you. <laughs> if anyone's going bird hunting, maybe go grab a snack first. <laughs> Thank you again, Blazing. Thank you all for being here! I love you! Have a wonderful day, guys.